This is my Melkin fan. This is my milker, Mimi. She's named for Memorial Day because that's when I got her. I call her Mimi for short. And the milk, first you uh, brush off her udder, squirt a little bit out of each teat in case there's some dirt in the mouth of the orifice. Then you wrap your finger and thumb around the teat and squeeze. Wrap your finger and thumb around the teat and then squeeze. The idea is if you put good feed in the feed pail of the milking stand, the goat gets used to eating in the milking stand, and she'll jump right up there when it's time to milk. You can milk into a glass bowl like I'm doing here, or a stainless steel pail or pot, and I have even used um, ice cream buckets. You get like a gallon pail of ice cream, although those are not as easy to keep sanitary. And then when you're done, you massage your udder just a little bit and get the last little bit of milk out. And I always tell her thank you.